I'm Alex Mahadevan with The Observer. As the Sarasota City Commission prepares to ban all signs in the public right of way, we checked in with downtown businesses to get their take on it. I feel it's an asset for our business because it gets the people, I, I think the people that are downtown as they're walking the sidewalks, they're looking at them. They're looking at things to see like what our specials we offer for today, um, what we can offer to them. Um, and without them being there, I think it'll be a really uh, a detriment to our business. They're very effective. If you're promoting a special or you're showcasing what you do as a business, whether it's a restaurant or another shop, uh, they're very important. You're, you're highlighting what it is that you're, you're, you're contributing to the community. The decision stemmed from a spat over signs discouraging panhandling downtown. I just think that that's unreasonable. I think that we all have to work together and I think the unity, you know, works much better than division. However, commissioners directed staff to look into ways to exempt commercial signage from the ordinance. We're excited about being downtown. I do think there uh, should be some restrictions on the signage that is allowed out there. I think it does get a little cluttery or people abuse it, but I do think there should be a bit of an opportunity for uh, a business owner to have some kind of signage, you know, with some kind of restrictions involved on it. But I haven't heard any complaints from anybody. You know, we always try to put it out of the way so it's not in the way of pedestrian traffic or anything like that. So I, I don't see a problem with them. We are very careful to, to make sure that there's a five foot right of way so people can walk by. Um, but, I, but I think it, we, do, we wouldn't want downtown to go into the direction it did 15 years ago. We need to have that vibrancy down here and we need some, some type of support from the city for that as well.